What is up, everybody? Welcome back, and welcome to Just Us Today. We're reacting to Hunter x Hunter episode 109. My name is Nathan. My name is Cameron. Stay hydrated. This summer, you guys. My name is Davion. You've been you've been wearing those things lately. Why? Take up. Well, it's hot. That's what, no. That that I get that. But like um, what are those called? Nathan, what are those called? Head wraps? Scarves? We're just gonna go with head wraps. You feel me? You've been wearing those a lot lately. Like, what are you trying to do? Add it to my style? You're supposed to get a haircut already? I'm gonna get my haircut on. That's mine, by the way. I it is, it is yours. Sir, uh, Saturday morning. Last episode of Hunter sure. Hunter. We, um. We not only got Kilua meeting up back with the gang. I can get used to this. <laughs> she go will ahead. never be over here. Go ahead, go ahead Karen. I'm gonna be. She said it was too spot. It's seasoned, Nathan. Are you sure you don't like it? There's milk in it. You're lactose intolerant. Exactly. Watch Nathan. Even if it kills me, I'm still gonna eat it. <laughs> oh, bro, did we get any update on what's happening with fucking um um what's the girl's name with the knives? I have no idea, about. Cameron. I have no idea. I call her knives. Uh, the girl who likes, Shoot. um, the girl who likes, uh, is it Kite? No, not Kite. Not Kite. No, uh, uh no. No, like, is it Nove? Yeah, it is Nove. It's Nove. Yeah, the girl who likes Nove. Um, last time I remember How do she... we not know her name? She's the one who, she's the one who went on the date with Gone. It's she's Palm. the one. Palm. There we go. Did we get any update on what she's doing with that, uh, last I saw, she was in Bro's bed? Not the last time I saw her. Uh, last I saw, she was in Bro's bed. After he went to sleep, she escaped. Then she noticed the aura. The aura that was in the hallway. The red aura, yeah. and that was it. And that was like the end of the episode, right? Yeah, and then I made the argument that I would hope that she could teleport out there, and Nathan was like, no, fuck. That makes no fucking sense, David. No, like, wait, that would make sense because no, no, what the fuck? No, made those portals. Exact. For, for, for Palm yeah. to escape. For people to get in and out if need be. But whatever. Come on, Nate. Are we watching Hunter or are you That's watching That's not what he said. He said for... He, a love, he wanted a love story to happen. There is a love story there. No, there's not. Palm feels no. the same way she felt about Go. No doesn't care about she Palm. She just wants fucking attention. No doesn't like Palm like And that. No is willing to give it. Also, last time. I feel like you're just a, her master. He's her teacher. I feel like you're just against love, Nathan. He's just her Don't teacher. be afraid of love. No, I'm not. <laughs> It's like, it's like now it's weird. Now I'm it's just weird. I'm, I'm calling her ass right now. Yeah. Weird. That's it. I'm joking. Um, yeah. And then um, yes. the king is starting to get feelings for humans, for a human. Not feelings like that, but feeling bad. Starting to have a soft spot. Yeah. Because he saw the chick who's almighty and great at Genji, and has been whooping the king's ass time and time again. Last we saw of her, she was getting her ass beat by... She was getting her ass beat? She was just getting attacked. Dude, I feel like when you put emphasis, when you put emphasis, emphasis on like something that happened, it just makes it that much more dramatic. I noticed that we do that a lot. Kimber, we are a reaction channel. Everything we do is dramatic. Literally everything we do is dramatic. I'm gonna blow it that hair right there? That was a dramatic ass choice. I've had this for fucking weeks, so... That makes no fucking Obviously, sense. you were going through a fucking crisis. Sense, David, Obviously, you do it. Relax, well, uh, relax, David. I'm just saying it wasn't dramatic of how she was getting her, how she was getting beat up. You, me? Was, you were sad. I was sad. Nathan was sad. That shit was fucked up. So she was getting her ass beat by birds. Not to yell at me, but I just felt bad. Cause she's blind, like, and you're doing, and she's doing. And, and Kevin, that's what I mean. That's why it made it that much more fucked up, like, and that's why the king was over here, like, bro, what the fuck? And he saved her. Smacked the fuck out of that bird. Oh, I just saw it, Nathan. You fucked it up for me. You ran across a little bit of it, and I saw a fucking cult. It's over. And My bad. It wasn't meant to. I just was going down to the play button. <laughs> like, um... All right, well, let's just get to the episode then. One day remains before the sorting, and the capital city, Beijing, wakes to a <coughs> quiet morning. That whole fit is so hard. Cameron, I really want you to learn calisthenics so you can do that. 
trying to, I'm really trying to fix my bed. Calgo will take the northeast elevator to the basement to search for Palm. If you find her, escape without us. You got it. So they're planning on entering the. Hesitate for one second, and it can mean death. We need to plan for every scenario and decide what we would do. Well, the killer was about it. I guess Peter was giving someone medical attention. What? I did tell you that Peter was the one who repaired Kite, didn't I? Damn! That should grow hella fast! That kid really grew up. The motherfucker was a penis! He's a. He's a. He has a tail! Maybe the king injured one of the royal guards for some reason? No. No, that's impossible. Pito would have to put the king in extreme danger by removing the end so that they could heal somebody else. And that's never gonna happen. I'm sure of it. Then the one who was injured... Was the king. Was the king. That fool literally ripped off his whole arm. I'll admit it. I didn't question our sudden stroke of luck too much. But that chance wouldn't have been possible under normal circumstances. Are they starting to lose control? Not good. I'm starting to think that something's going to go wrong. Damn, they're hella far. We will now begin moving to the palace. Citizens of Sector A1, assemble in Diego Plaza at once. Citizens of the other sector. Yeah, the uh, the sorting's starting. So at least one of us. Must stay close by the king's side and guard him throughout the entire sorting. You know, he would never allow us to do that. The king's been irritated enough with us because of how close we've been covering him as it is. Then we guard him secretly, without his knowledge. He wouldn't like that. Someone whose size won't draw attention and who won't get distracted by an amusing task. Me. Very well, then. Clearly the best choice we have. <laughs> That's the worst choice. I will be quite proud to me. <laughs> okay. Do you think there's any chance they'll decide to cancel the march altogether? Oh yeah, can't he no, hide no everything? Way. That guy right there? That would mean delaying or even canceling the entire Yeah, but he has to hold his breath. So weird. How they're on like that like puppet stream. He has his puppets too though. <laughs> How is Nov just doing that for them? Like, like it's already been placed. We won't be able to get our hands on any useful new information. We'd just be flying blind. I just want to know who's going to fight with Moro now. Because Nov backed out. So it's like, bro, but this motherfucker has to fight alone now? I, I say, fuck that, bro. But you were the one who said it would be too risky for us to wait outside the palace. Yes. Based on what I've seen, you shouldn't take their security net too lightly. I'll yeah. handle it. Huh? Oh, let's go, Nov! He's back. I'm the only one among us who can enter and exit these rooms whenever I please. Did it. I'll keep you all. Did he? What the fuck? Yeah, that dies here. I'll be close, but right outside of Pito's in range. So. Are you okay? Be as careful. It's a true fighter's instinct to want a real sense of how strong his opponent is. And his instinct led him to underestimate them. That was his downfall. That's like that end can extend up to two kilometers. Okay, that's not fair. Kite had to save the boys, so yeah, but not. I mean, if they didn't get caught, wouldn't have to save him. But what I mean is, his arm was taken because he was trying to save them. Any risks ever again? Damn. So he's overcome that fear. Well, no. He said he won't take that risk ever again. He said he'll never take risks ever again. Yeah. You see his eyes? Yeah. He's not, if he's overcome that fear, then he'll take the risk. Hey man, like, hair is either white now from stress or it's like blonde. That's weird. From this point on, you'll keep an eye on Komogi as well and deal with any threats at once. Ooh. Yes. As you wish. <laughs> what if, what if Komogi's th threat is Palm? Because remember how Palm was hella like he wanted to kill her? Okay, real quick. What no, if not they... Palm. What was his name? Huh? Poof. 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 Real quick, Aaron. 
What if the king was over you like, the fuck? Did I dismiss you? <laughs> Your computer? Oh, my bad. <laughs> he, he is that stressed. He has no, white hair now. That's insane. The march of death. It will be dark before much longer. <laughs> so his hair was just aging because he was that stressed? He's that stressed, yeah. Look at that white hair now. That's insane. Six hours to go. <laughs> That's a gangster ass octopus, man. Kilowa in particular, he shows none of the vulnerability he displayed when we fought. Hey. It's like he's overflowing with confidence. You love to see it. But I can't help but wonder why is it that now and then he seems so sad? Mm. He thought he was going to lose going, right? No, you see. Now and then, not then to now. I know. So then he was sad. No, now and then, like randomly, he get like he seems sad. But no. Yes. They said, why does he seem happy now, opposed to then? No, he says now and then. He right. seems sad. No, Nathan. Yes. No. What? How did you not get that? No. How did you not get that? What? On a scale of one to a hundred, I'm about a forty. Yeah. 35. Yeah. yeah. Can't cry about it now. With no vout, I'm the only one left. This man is literally depressed. <laughs> Tomorrow at midnight, I will, I be, will reborn. be reborn. Why is everybody having this cathartic moment? Thank you for that, Kilua. I <laughs> promise to carry out my mission for you. Tomorrow. Will be my birthday. Bro, I fuck with Ikago, bro. Next reaction, we're whole ass singing "Happy Birthday" for Brandon. <laughs> okay. Oh I'll god. Let you die. Next reaction. <laughs> <laughs> Again. We sing "Happy Death Day." Like. Why you always gonna be so dark? <laughs> just say, this arc is fucking dark. <laughs> this arc is hella fucking dark. I am king. But who am I really? Miriam. Our time's up. Let's go. Four o'clock already. So the next episode is for sure definitely almost a fight, right? Yeah. Two or like two or three episodes. Ten minutes remain until they enter the palace. Damn. We are definitely getting a fight next episode. Not even a fight. They're just finally entering the palace. So like the long, the long awaited like, ugh, finally is finally happening. You know what I'm saying? The long awaited finally is finally, finally happening. Exactly. Moment I've been fucking waiting for. Oh shit. I don't think anybody dies this next episode though. I would hope they fight Pedo, but I don't think anybody dies this episode. And as sad as it is, dude, if bro's at 35%, that's wild. And he says he's just gonna accept his fate, I think he full fledged expects to go in there and die. I cannot believe no fucking quit. I understand though, but I cannot believe he fucking quit. Kim, that fool was so fucking scared. His hair turned from pitch black to snow which white. Which makes me think, which makes me think he's going to come back somehow, some way, and then die and be like, I have nothing to be afraid of. Some shit. I think he's going to have one of those moments. I think. What? What? Nate's going to say some shit about that? What? No. Nate's going to say some shit about this. Guarantee you, in the midst of his death, He's gonna be like, don't worry. It's okay. I've already found my one true love. I can die in peace. Bro, he has never said he loved Pong. He's just making up a love story. I mean, it's interesting, but like, cause, cause what if he, what if Palm dies? And that gets him that to- gets no like, oh hell no, I have to. No, so what if, so no, no, no. So, if, so even if it wasn't even a love story, what if like some, one of the good, one of the good guy characters die and it happens to be Palm. So he's gonna be like, oh hell no. Now Nove has nothing to be scared of. Cause now he's gonna be like, no, fuck that. That's what I'm saying. I, even if I didn't like her like that, she liked me for who I was and made me feel confident. So no, fuck that, I'm getting in there. I'm getting in there. Come for, it's gonna, either gonna be Palm or Moral. That'd be cute as fuck. One of them are gonna die and Nove's gonna be like, yeah, fuck this. And he's gonna get in there. It's just not happening, I guarantee you. He's not fighting a single You're just against you. love. That's what I'm saying. Why can't you just ship for love? Cause they've never, he's not, he doesn't love her. Just like she didn't love God, right? Palm is fucking a psychopath. Love Psycho is love. Psychopaths game don't deserve love. Thank you. Uh, I, no, not from, not from Nov, cause he doesn't love her. 
But he, he has does. not shown a single ounce of love towards her. All you, all you've ever seen is Palm likes attention. He randomly came back, so now she's back to wanting him. What did she say? But, what did she say to her? He said something to her that made her go on his own. Yeah, you feel me? Because I remember she was chasing him coming back. No, it wasn't just him coming back. Cause she, I remember go, she was chasing going down the street with knives and then ran into him or something like that, right? Nathan just doesn't want to ship love. There's no love there. But there is. No, there isn't. There's a but there psychopath is. who wants attention and her teacher. I want to understand this. How much, has time, how much time has one passed? What the hell is this fucking cult has this kid, what, three? This kid, like, three years old? <laughs> the, like, the fuck, it must grow faster than... I mean, have you seen the ants? You see how fast they grow? That's true. The ants obviously is special in some type of way. But where the hell is Colt raising this kid at? Like, whoever that fucking house was, right? I'm trying to figure out, like... Oh, I know where. Remember when... Remember when, um... What is his name? The Colt. almighty strong dude. Colt. Mr. Nettero? Oh, Mr. Nettero. Remember Mr. Nettero got a call from the uh, the boss or whatever saying that this is what I need you to do, right? I feel like wherever Mr. Nettero was, that's the house that they're at. That should look like a fucking skyscraper where Mr. Nettero was. And I'm pretty sure there's a room there that they can help with that okay, baby. but we saw the house that they're at. That shit was a normal-ass house. That looked like a big-ass mansion type house. That shit was huge. That shit wasn't in the city as a, as a skyscraper. No, though. that shit wasn't in the city. Mr. Nettero was literally in the city, like, at a skyscraper. And then you don't believe in love. You can't say shit to me. <laughs> you don't believe in love. I do believe in love. That's why I'm shipping that. There's nothing there. I'm fucking with Novin Pony. I'm, I'm fucking with Novin Pony. If came a thing, I'd be fucking with it. And that's what I'm saying, bro. Just ship love, all right? That shit's gonna happen, and it's gonna be awesome. I just... Oh, my God, bro. I just... I'm more interested in what's gonna happen in the next two episodes. Even if it's not the next episode, the next two Nathan. What? The next oh yeah. The next two episodes, you just added a frame for me. I feel like in the next two episodes we're actually gonna see like probably, quite possibly, one of the actually, you think you think if there was a fight between the Royal Guards, it shouldn't last one episode? No. That's just no, gonna last there's two. There's no episodes. way those fights are gonna last like one episode. Hell to no. Okay, I feel like cause it's not just gonna be one fight. Well no while Pito is fighting Kiyua and going over here, there's gonna be a whole other fight over here. So in the midst of all, they have, there's gonna be there's not gonna be enough screen time to be able to plan to do all fights. It's gonna happen in three moves or three uh, episodes. Three moves. I'm thinking this shit's chess. I know. That's all this whole thing. Like, oh, you wanna play a game? I yeah, you know. I'm down to get a match for you. Please. Hell yeah, dude. Let's fucking do it, bro. Um. Yeah. That's freaking where we're at. Anything you're, anything you're looking forward to next episode, Nate? You haven't seen next episode. No. No, I'm not kidding. I was going to be like, oh, what the fuck you guys are? I figured, like, uh, because isn't... <gasps> didn't they say something about um, Hunter coming back? Yeah, Hunter's now... Or the, the dude just now started... Just got back into writing the manga. So we don't have 40-something episodes left. No. Cause after these, after, cause no, cause only in, we're, we're in like the, we're in like the, uh, we're in the home stretch. Yeah, the home stretch. So now it's like probably like thirty five or something like that. More episodes left, but then we're gonna have more written after these thirty five. Yeah, but I think we're gonna have to go to Crunchyroll for that. Have we even talked about? Have we even talked about the next? Ma, one? The, ma, season seven is not gonna come out for a while. What are you looking at me for? I don't, I didn't. I not agree. All that. I said was we're gonna have to go to Crunchyroll for did that. We, did we? How, uh, do you, how do you know we're gonna have to go to Crunchyroll for that? If season seven, it's not gonna, if they make a season seven, that's just not gonna come out for years. Years, plural. Yes, years. Okay. Mm-hmm. Otherwise, they would already have a season seven for what they have in the manga. Probably in the works. That's just gonna be freaking gas, dude. We're just gonna, we're just gonna have to wait for it to get on streaming services. Just keep on waiting. Follow it on Twitter. Talk for Danny. Thank you guys all for watching. Good evening, like a lot of What? What? Just Nathan being Nathan. Love to all you guys in the comments. We want to see you guys on Twitter as well. So please follow us at just underscore SYT as in YouTube to catch up on the conversations you may have. Oh, wait, no.
You guys can't hit the notification bell bottom right. <laughs> yeah, you got it. <laughs> Let's figure out upcoming content. If you miss anything, you can look at the bottom left hand corner to watch some content you may have missed. Do appreciate the love we get from platform to platform. But if you can hit, if you can't hit us with a like, comment, and subscribe, because we do appreciate it. If you didn't know, my name is Cameron. I'm Davion. And it's always been just a